Welcome back, everybody. Thanks for joining us here on the Model Explainer segment on Weather Plus. GFS model, we're checking out the upper levels of the atmosphere. We're starting off with the weekend. A lot of things going on this weekend across the Allegheny. So we're going to look at Saturday. and. Looks to be a fairly benign pattern. However, you do notice a little bit of a dip in the parts of the high contours here across parts of Indiana. Another one across parts of Ohio. Those are very weak short waves that are going to try and move through as we head into the weekend. So while it's not going to rain constantly, it does look like once we get into Saturday and Sunday, we do stand the chance of seeing a few pop up afternoon storms. Much larger area of low pressure back off to our west and northwest. This will slowly ease its way off to the east and southeast as we get into Sunday. But the bulk of that system and the bulk of its cool air do look to remain north and mainly northwest of the area because as this does move east it will shear apart or weaken and not have a whole lot of impact across the local area. So here we are on Sunday. Again, we continue with basically a zonal flow, just a little bit of troughing heading into parts of Ohio. And again, that could set off a late day shower or storm. But for the most part, the weekend looks dry, warm, sunny. We just have to watch out for those late afternoon and evening storms. There goes that system as we head into Monday. Again, it's losing a lot of its definition as it moves its way across parts of southeastern Canada, northern Great Lakes. So it will continue to fall apart as we head into Monday afternoon. You notice the high contours bubbling up in behind it here back off to the west and the southwest indicative of ridging building across parts of the central U.S. and as that ridge continues to build as we get into the early part of the week temperatures are going to start to come back up. We'll cool off a little bit it looks like into the day on Monday but by Tuesday Look at this. This is a big heat wave ridge building here across parts of the southern plains. This is going to come out, it looks like, as we head into the new week, as we get closer to the 4th of July. Again, by Tuesday, warm enough, that 582 height contour right through Pennsylvania, so that will boost temperatures up into the 80s. And by Wednesday, that 588 line right up to the Pennsylvania-Maryland border.